Hey everyone, I'm Almar of AlmarsGuides.com and in this video here I'm going to show you how to get a unique item in the Siege of Dragon Spear expansion pack which can only uh, be acquired when your group has been waylaid by enemies in uh, one of the specific waylay zones in the Siege of Dragon Spear expansion. So where I'm going, I'm going right now between uh, Trollclaw Woods, Forest of Worms, and Borskier Bridge. In this area, there's a chance that I'm going to be... There we go. I just got waylaid. So this is one of the two waylaid events that can happen in this area. This one gives us access to the Mykonid Cave, which uh, we get through going through this pit. And there's going to be goblins along the outside and Mykonids in the cave on the inside. If I'm not mistaken, the goblins on the outside don't have any good loot of value. And they're pretty easy to take out with just a single fireball like that. Oh man, I don't want to deal with this. That, uh, if my characters run in there, then I'm going to have to deal with the, them getting stuck and it's a whole mess. So, as you can see, they don't drop much loot. This, uh, short sword is like the only item, I think, that wasn't ammo, yeah. So let's ID the short sword. I can show you what that is. But this is the main item we want from this waylaid area. The main item we want from this waylaid area is in this pit. There will be a uh, Elven Chainmail plus one inside this pit. So this video will show you how to get the Elven Chainmail plus one magical item. And the reason I didn't announce that at the start of the video is because there's multiple different waylades you can get by circling through these areas. You either get this one with the Myconid Cave, or you get another one with a young green dragon that calls for help. And, uh, oh, this bow. This bow is the magical item that uh, you get from here that's good, if I'm not mistaken. Eh, it's not bad. Composite longbow plus one. I could have sworn the goblins dropped something. The bow is probably it. But this is the Myconid Cave. This is the main area that we're... Uh, that we're seeking after. All those mechanics are defeated. Now let's go up here and our item will be up here. Out of the way, Mykonids. So our item should be in this little stash over... Actually, here's a... Uh, it's on the ground. I thought it was in the little stash. But anyway, this is the item that uh, we're after. Elven Chainmail. The main thing that's good about this is uh, it will allow you to use... Uh, it'll still allow you to cast spells while you have that equipped. Which is uh, very, very, very useful for any of your multi-class characters that are able to use spells while also wearing heavier armor such as that. As far as the sword, let me uh, enchant or ID that. Spellbreaker plus two. This is a pretty good weapon, as you can see. It's not bad. It's a long sword that basically gives you, uh, will dispel magic on critical hit. And it's got decent rolls, too. But anyway, that is uh, that is all there is to this area. As you can see, it's pretty straightforward. Uh, the hardest part is going to be actually unlocking this waylaid area because which waylaid uh, you get is going to be random. So that's something to keep in mind. But anyway, that really is all there is to it. If this video helped you out, be sure to leave me a like because that helps me out. And aside from that, I will catch you guys around in future Baldur's Gate 1 Siege of Dragonspear videos. Peace.